Guff. I saw Guff on the YouTube channel Ill Flips, which is a great channel. Uh, the, the guy, I can't think of his name, I believe he's Irish. He puts out his own comics and he collects zines and uh, independent comics. And he also purchases like European books and Japanese manga, really nice stuff he gets. He shared some, uh, some work that he picked up at a convention <clears throat> And Guff, he shared these, and I was very impressed with what I what I saw. I liked the 3D covers, the stark yellow and black, and the large size. And I checked out the creator Kai Reynolds' uh, Instagram, and he he hadn't yet put up number three for sale yet, but he got on it, and I purchased all three issues, and they arrived last night or yesterday, and I read them last night, and I love these. These are these are quite. A unique, funny, scrappy uh, comic anthology, all done by one person from England, Shipley, England, I believe. And there is his Instagram. It's the Half Digested Boy. Just to give you a look inside, very scrappy. Uh, I like it. Kind of reminds me of maybe uh, Gary Panter or. Um, Mark Newgarden, I believe his name is, and um, some other, uh, i trying to remember who was the uh, guy I was thinking of on this page. Anyway, I, I like this a lot. There's a lot of funny moments in this. I was laughing out loud. The Autopsy, MK28 was classic. I love this one a lot. Um, then we get some of these mixed media. I like this a lot, the way it looks. Looks great. Um, some humor. This one's really good as well. Eternal Sightless Churning Void. Like this moment here. He's attending a funeral, this character that we see. He's taking a shower. And you get this scene where they're driving down the street, yet it looks like it's toys, like play, uh, like little models set up and things like that. Quite, quite unique storytelling. Let's see really quick here. <laughs> Fine dining, pretty good. Working with like Zipatone or something here. Uh, sorry, my lights are a little low. Let me bring them up here. It might help a little better when I come in close. Yeah, funny, funny magazine. This kind of reminds me of maybe uh, like Crumb meets Rubber Blanket. Uh, I think Richmond Lewis, Mazzuccelli's wife, did a strip. A couple strips of rubber blanket kind of reminds me of that just the uh the mark making and the the shadows and the scrap i keep saying scrappiness but uh, I, th I thought hate and rockets was, was fantastic funny ass story funny ass strip so there's guff number one here's guff number two uh continues this is kind of funny one of the 12 people shown above is me cartoonist mastermind behind guff identify the right person and text your answer too for a big wet so that's kind of funny. Uh, this one was pretty good too. He, it, I, it took me a moment to realize what was going on, um, but he is he is reproducing his sketchbook when he went on a trip back to his his um, old house, the property of Kai Elliot Reynolds. Um, funny stuff. Very. I don't know. I, I just like the way he uh, present his presents his stories. Uh, very, I don't want to say scrappy. It's it's very like immediate, I guess. Very uh, like that. Uh, co just copying the pages of the sketchbook it has a nice quality to it. Grandma's house. Let me make sure I'm in focus. Grandma's house and impenetrable loneliness. And it the 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 issues. This one was hilarious too. Puppy hate. I thought that was great. 
this one here. Uh, summoning Circle. I like that a lot as well. Painterly and just mark making, I thought was, was great. And finally, um, Guff number three. But these came uh, securely packaged. It was very nice. Uh, they come with a big, thick piece of board just to keep them nice and straight. Again, I like the oversize. I like just the yellow, the stark yellow. Very iconic, very memorable to me. The way it, the way it uh, presented. This is this one. This is the first one I read. I mistakenly thought this was number one, and I read our, our little clown Pedrito. It's, I was cracking up on that. His road race, a collage piece. Uh, I saw on his, I just looked this morning, he's, he's done a lot of collage in his sketchbooks. This one was pretty good too. <clears throat> Here's one that's done all with, uh, I don't know what this, some type of text, or whatever this called, but I thought that was really good. Just to the variety is, is quite good on this. I like this one too. Um, it sounds like this one is going to be continued. The Silver Dagger experience will be continued in guff number four. But I really like the way that face comes out in these uh, cityscapes. Thank you so much at Kai Reynolds for uh, the Guff books. I, I look forward to issue four and beyond. And thanks to Ill Flips. Check out his channel as well for uh, turning me on to a bunch of stuff that I'm now curious to uh, see. There you go. There's Guff. And here's the little, uh, did I mention this already? This was included as well, this print. So thank you. Hate and rockets. All you care about is making rockets. You don't love me anymore. Oh yeah? <laughs> I love you. You really do love me. Of course, dear. Almost as much as I hate the neighbors.